in this podcast we will speak about the age-related demoscopic nevus patterns. Studies suggest that the number and demoscopic patterns of nevi vary with age. In fact, nevus count increases from puberty until midlife and thereafter decreases. The topic of this podcast will be delivered in four separate parts which are related to the main periods of life. These four main periods of life are childhood, adolescence, adulthood and late adulthood. It is advisable to listen to these four podcasts beginning with part one followed by parts 2, 3 and 4. This will be part 3 and here we will speak about the demoscopic nevus patterns of adulthood. Adulthood is the period between the age of 20 to approximately 60 years of age. The great majority of nevi in adults will exhibit a reticular pattern. Like shown in this example, a uniform reticular nevus. The nevus count and the nevus patterns in adults depend on the skin type and a genetical background of the given individual. It has been shown that the nevus pattern vary between different persons with different skin type. In persons with a fair skin type, nevi are usually large, show a red to light brown coloration, a central hypopigmentation and are predominantly dermal or compound nevi upon histopathology. On the other hand, in persons with a dark skin type, nevi are usually small, dark brown, show a central hyperpigmentation and are predominantly compound or junctional nevi. Also the genetical background has an impact on the nevus pattern and basically we can differentiate between two scenarios, persons with few small nevi and persons with multiple large nevi. Most nevi in persons with few small nevi will reveal a uniform reticular pattern like shown in this example. On the other hand, most nevi in a person with this skin type and this nevus pattern will show a large size and a reticular mixed pattern composed by central globules or structureless areas and a peripheral network. Here one example, central globules surrounded by a network. Another example with a more structureless brown pattern, but still we can recognize at the periphery a reticular pattern. In summary, nevi in adulthood mostly reveal variations of a reticular pattern.